Mai versus Rebel, Land of Fire, King of the Sea qualifiers, day two. Oh, uh, wait. So. What the hell? Green team, my team, are going to be running Ohio, Conqueror, Minotaur, Golden Lou, Venezia, Moskva, Daring, Daring, Vampire 2. What have you got? I have a Vermont question mark. Uh, Yamato, Des Moines, Venezia, Double Stalin, Daring, Marceau, and Wagner. Okay. Uh, so, Henning, first question. Why Vermont? I mean... What? <laughs> like, I... I I guess the idea is to have like some Action interesting stations. angles on like a station or a cruiser or something that you just completely murderize with a salvo or something like that. Uh -huh. The problem is where more can't rotate because, you know, it well, doesn't really move. She big, she thick, she... She's not really good at rot I mean, she has a good turning circle, but that's the only rotation she ever does. <laughs> not to rotate from one map, the one side of the map, the other. I think, I, like, I think Vermont's top speed is what, 24 knots? Something like that? Something, something along those lines, yes. Yeah. It's not great. Yeah. Like, it also has a higher hit point pool that's very misleading considering it's a circle. So, have fun trying to angle a circle against in incoming fire. Mm hmm. Alright, so. Let's so, how's your deployment? And this deployment, we're going to be sending over the air cap. We're going to be sending a Minotaur and a Golden Lou. Uh huh. I just said that. We're also going to be sending a Moskva at a back moment. I think the Conqueror might be joining them. Uh, B cap, we're going to be sending both a Vampire 2 and a Daring. And then over to the, a uh, to the C cap, sorry, we're going to be sending a Daring, Venezia, and Ohio. Not very much in the way of radar on this side of the map. So once that cap goes, it goes, and you're not getting them back. What have you got? I've got a Ratna going towards a, a starting guard taking the very safe round, uh, a safe route towards the two lane, probably, to support it. As well as the Vermont, I guess it's trying to go A, so we're going to like, see it arrive in like five minutes. Mm. Meanwhile, B is going to get contested by the Daring, with the Venezia giving close support, actually popping a smoke already, even though it can't really be anything smart. I guess it's just to protect itself from the turn. Because um, he is going in front of the island. He was briefly and... spotted. Ah, okay. That's what the that. little grey exclamation mark means. Oh. Yeah. And meanwhile on C, we have the Maso just driving right into it, being super fast. Uh, the mine behind it, as well as the start and the Yamato going towards C as well. I'm interested to see if the Demoin is going to the 10 line or if, it, uh, if it's going to stop at the 8 line island. Or so, maybe the starting guard is going to go 10. So the Yamato is cer most certainly not going to do that though. One thing I want to talk about is this Ragnar versus Minotaur that's going to be happening at the air cap. Um, Ragnar loses. <laughs> and Mega Heart, yes. Yeah. <laughs> End of now, it doesn't really have any way to defend itself, considering, well, there are no tops. Yeah, no tops, you can't yell Minotaur. You can't, look, if you catch that Minotaur off guard, sure, you can devastate it with your AP. But good luck doing that. Because it's gonna be uh, really Even if you get all it. sits, it's still gonna murder ice here before you kill it. Yeah, and it's gonna be super healing through that with its improved Citadel repair. Um, also, at Sea Cap did take a little bit of chip damage, so did the mines. Oh, Wagner did get weighed out here by the, by the Minotaur. Nothing should have shot, though. Now Wagner is riding back. Is anything else? Venezia shot? and the Vermont might both have a shot on the Red Minotaur here. Oh, we're about to find out. Yep, yep there, there we, we go. Venezia is shooting AP. The Minotaur is angled. That shouldn't do much. The Mont on the other hand. Vermont, however, kind of doesn't care, but only gets... I think it was only one hit in. Yeah. Yeah, B falls into the hands of MMI, considering they have Vampire Daring versus only a Daring, considering the Venezia actually went all the way to A now. C Cap Daring does get spotted at the north of it. I'm not sure if he's going to be... What happened to the Des Moines of our medals on C? Oh, he got Ohio, never mind. Yeah. He's about to get Ohio again. Oh, he's about to get Mossbot now. Uh, he's dead. He's just straight up dead. He needs to stop firing at he's good. Yeah. And pray that this doesn't kill him. Venezia should still have shots, Moscow still has shots, Ohio still has shots, Daring can even come out and finish him off. <laughs> he is living, but he's still spotted, and there's a Venezia salvo. Moscow salvo, Conqueror salvo. He is alive, and he is despotted now. However, Daring's gonna come around this corner and respot I think they did a one can be oh, he's yeah, spotted. The mine is spotted for a second. Ohio shot, And he's despotted already. The Ohio salvo is out though, and this one looks good. Oh no. 
Oh no. There we go. And goes. there he goes. Yeah, that is just overpeaked way too hard on the left side of that island. You can't do that. Yeah, Mosco, I mean, Mosco did take the sea cap on the back of that. Mosco is currently spotted in front of the daring. At some point, the Minotaur and the Ragnar had a fight, apparently. <laughs> uh, okay. Yep, the Ragnar still spotted. 2,000 health, 500 health. Minotaur raining down AP onto his bow. Ragnar, using that improved engine boost to try and dodge as many shells as possible, goes down. The Minotaur's gonna live here. He's, he's put it immediately, and he can just sit in, in A again. The Ragnar left the island position. I don't know why he did that. I... There wasn't no pressure there. And, well, you know... You can't win this against the Minotaur, he's just gonna have shit on you. I, maybe he went out to dodge an airstrike or something? I have no idea. Even then, the airstrike is not gonna do that much on a small target like a Wagner. Yeah, well... Especially since you can, like, wiggle away a little bit. Well, back over at the sea cap, we see a Yamato push! Uh, any? Um, I see a Yamato next, uh, being surrounded by 3 DD, so that's gonna be fun. I see a chain of conga line torpedoes that he has stopped directly in front of. Uh, yeah. Mm. He also has a Veneta on his broad side, so yes. that's also fun. So... Mm. And the Ohio in his face, and, well, yeah, no. One, two, three, four, five. It's gonna be 5 only, but um, that's gonna force damage gun for sure, and he has a Moskva Vampire sh aging him. Yep. He has no way to lead spot, because, well, there's a dead in his face. He's very, very, very extended. He's very dead. I'm, I'm, I'm not a fan of this Mo Yamato position. I'm, I must say. <laughs> he has adopted central positioning. Briefly. Yes. And the yeah. Yamato goes down. That's a big whip. Yeah, On B, the Darings found each other and are trying to trade. Yeah, yeah Rabbit's Daring actually losing this trade heavily. Yeah. It's now down 8,000 HP compared to the MMI Daring. A cap are about to try and push the Minotaur with the Stalingrad and the Vermont, I think. I <laughs> The problem is the Minotaur is ready to just stop whatever comes around. Yeah, this is what, this is a fantastic Minotaur position. Because if anything tries to YOLO you, you'll see it coming because of your Hydro. If your Hydro is down, you've got your radar. And you have, like, all of the torpedo threat in the world. But he tries to rush you, you just have your guns instead. And you can accelerate out to start mitigating damage yep. as well. The Ohio actually tried to spot a plane, shoot the star, and go at 29 kilometers and gets an overpin. <laughs> nice attempt. Uh, Daring's back, bottom of B respotting each other. This could be a fight of the death. This will be a fight of the death. Yeah. Rebel's Daring mi uh, missed the top, so he's gonna die here. Yep, taking full AP and it was broadside. The question is if they can kill Big big Quack and return, but the Venezia is very far away, so I don't think he's gonna be able to do that. So yeah, Rebel is down four ships at this point, so this is gonna be rough to come back from. They, need, they really need to do something on A. Like, yeah. Like, and they don't need to do it right now. Oh, they they're, about to, they're about to send the Stalingrad into the Minotaur's torpedoes. If the Stalingrad goes full speed here, I am pretty sure the Minotaur does not have the angle to top that. He does now. He's he's stopped. Well, and now the um, Stalingrad's just stopping there and getting the Minotaur farmer's bow. Also, the Conqueror is now in a position to just shoot the Stalingrad's board when he comes around. And now the Moscow's raining in AP and the broadside of the Mont. Stalingrad yeah, the Lamar is not happy about all of this. He got found by the Conqueror, got behind that island to shot block, and now he's getting shot by the Moss and the Ohio. Meanwhile, the Daring is sneaking up behind him. Ohio from downtown on the broadside of this Vermont as well. Let's see how much of this does. Could have been worse. Respect the Vermont. Yeah, the Golden Louvre is not taking any amount of damage that will force him away here. But that was a lag and a half. Are you having issues? Minotaur torpedoes coming out. Um, oh, these are a bit early. These are way too early. Venezia had uh, zap, loaded. zap loaded. It's not going to kill the Minotaur, but it's going to do you a lot of damage. The Minotaur's going to dodge these stops. Yeah, but well, now my, uh, Stalingrad knows he can accelerate because that so it's like that set of torpedoes is no longer ready. Minotaur has to do yep. a full turn if he wants to get the other set off. Minis are gonna take a lot of damage here. Uh, Conqueror Cyber is also out. 
He can't even kill the Minotaur. Oh, That's dear. Stalingrad should be able to just finish off this Minotaur, right? Overmatch. Minotaur going to turn full broadside, dump his Torps right, preferably. Yeah, there he is. goes. Doesn't get his Torps off. They finally make something happen, but it was at the cost of their Venets here. That's not a ship they could afford to lose. They're currently five to one ships down. Stalingrad yeah. going to be brawling in Ohio on the, the Stalingrad is in a horrible crossfire at this point between the Moskva, Golden Luz, and the Kong. Mm -hmm. There he goes. He's not going to be long for this world. And then this other Stalingrad, that, yep, yep, just, just, right, well. Yeah, FC collapse can complete at this point. Like in the back one, we just see the Moscow being radar down to 2.8k as well. He's, he actually just dies. The Stalin dies as well. And <laughs> now know. we have a solo Vermont. Uh-huh. So, <laughs> Web is about to lose to getting zeroed, the enemy getting a thousand points, and losing all their ships at the same time. All three Yikes. victory conditions. Well, is, hang on, is the Vermont going to die? Is the Vermont actually going to manage to die? It is 30,000 health that you still need to chew through. You have like 40 seconds to do it. Locking points to give you a bit more time because he's generous like that. 27,000. Burning a fire, 24,000. He might, they might make it. They might get this kill. 13,000. Oh. It's going to be close. 100 oh, health. Vermont goes down, yeah. and they get the triple crown. Zeroing 1,000 points and killing all enemy ships. Uh, MMI with the, uh, with, well, well, with the three victories at once. Does that count as three points or just one, Henning? It's only, it does only count as one. Unfortunately. That was a commanding win, though. Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah, it's unfortunately doing a lot of mistakes, posi uh, positioning-wise. Uh, uh, the Des Moines just overextending right at the start, the Yamato following the Des Moines example, and the Wagner deciding to like go out and fight one on one a Minotaur. Not the best idea, unfortunate for them. Yeah. So, uh, Henning, what is our next game of the day? Our next game of the day is going to be a mid versus.